Hey guys, and welcome back to more World of Guns Gun Assembly. Today we're doing the Mossberg 500. Let's hop to the game mode. So this gun, some pieces give me a little bit of trouble, but we'll kind of do our best here. I did say some practicing, but there's certain pieces I just keep on forgetting. So we'll continue on with the tradition of moving pieces as they're removed, which you guys probably get tired of me saying. You gotta remove this pin. Then trigger housing comes out. I like to disassemble this whole piece first. So once the trigger assembly's out, you can move the cartridge stop and the cartridge interrupter. Okay, and you pull the bolt lock. The slide pulls back and this falls down. You don't move that yet. You move the elevator. This comes forward, you move the elevator. Okay, then you move the wind four block assembly and the slide action. Okay, then you can reach in and grab the bolt assembly. This time, remove your ejector assembly, your picanti rail, your safety button, your magazine, the magazine assembly, and then move the windstock assembly, because then you know that all is done. Okay, so that's all done, you don't have to worry about it. I just gotta take apart the remaining pieces here we have. So we have a right hand extractor, a left hand extractor, a bolt lock, and then a firing pin assembly. So that's disassembled. This is where things get a little bit more complicated and I always forget the order. But mainspring first, then I believe it's the hammer, and then it's the trigger, followed lastly by the action lock assembly which goes up on this side. Okay, then there'll be a sear assembly there, and this little housing pin detent. So then you're good. And since this is the hardest part to do, we'll do it first. So the detent, the sear assembly, the action lock lever assembly, the trigger assembly, if you do it right away, it's not as scary. That's what I always say. Hammer assembly. Mainspring assembly. So we're over that. Firing pin assembly here. Bolt lock. Like I always say, do it in the opposite order that you just did it in. Okay. We're gonna just put that in. That's not, that's not perfectly opposite order, but it pretty much is. So wooden stock assembly. Magazine assembly. Magazine. Safety button. Make sure you put in your safety button before you put anything back else back in. Needs to be done. Picanti. Picanti can be done at any time, but I like doing it that time. Okay, so what did we put in first? What we have to put in first, very first, is the bolt assembly. Okay, what did we move second? It's the wooden foresight forearm assembly. Okay, then we did magazine. So yeah, if you follow exactly as you did it last round, bolt slide, okay, then you go forward, you're good. Cartridge stop, cartridge interrupter, hat trigger housing, your trigger pin. Don't forget your bearer insert. You should have 67. This is a piece and that's a piece. 68, 69. Done. So that's your sniper serenity. So. Gamer time one, expert sniper top. We actually got top three and I talked throughout the whole thing. So what do we have? We have 353. So I could easily probably cut a minute off that, but like I said, or like I was thinking, you can probably get it on these modes. Ah, eh, maybe not. These guys are pretty fast. But we'll see. There's always lots of room to get these. These are in the areas where it's pretty easy to get top. But, we just gotta do it now. On Super Game. So. Barrel. Insert. Pin, trigger housing, S 
stop. Purchase interrupter. Bolt slide. Elevator. Form assembly. Oh, missed that one. There's one down. Bolt assembly. Projector assembly. Canty rail. Safety. Magazine. One stock assembly. Okay, I think that's all those pieces. Continue on. Right hand extractor. Oops, I flipped all the way around. Left hand extractor. Bolt lock. Firing pin. Perfect. We did all that. We did all that. So we just think of this. So remember our order. Reach and grab the mainspring assembly. Then the hammer assembly. Then the trigger assembly. Action lock lever assembly. Sear assembly. And trigger housing detent pin. We forgot one other piece. Um, a small piece. Somewhere, just let me think. We got the left or right? We got that. We got this, we got that. We got the insert. Oh, yeah, we forgot our magazine assembly. I always forget something, but it's no problem. That might have cost us first place, but really it's not the end of the world. Okay. Let's put this back together so we don't forget how we did it. So assembly. Okay. So, it's this piece next. Make sure you think about it. If you if you don't know, give it a thought a second before you click, because you're gonna you'll lose your whole super game if you're wrong. Um Hammer assembly here next. And main spring assembly. Extra slide assembly. Front pin assembly. Bolt lock assembly. Right hand extractor. Left hand extractor. Okay, so that's allowed all that. I put the thing back in the magazine already so we can put the magazine back on. Projector, anti rail, safety button, put in stock assembly, we need to put the insert back in. Okay, so remember our order here. That's reassembled completely. So bolt assembly. And then for what for stock member you lose automatically if you screw it up. So do some thinking if you're not sure. Okay. Then elevator. Yes, okay good. Then bolt slide. The two stops. The trigger housing. How's it pin? You're at 67, and you have 68, 69 right there. So what do we get? 4 minutes 25. Craftsman Serenity, Lightning Fast Reflexes. So we didn't even get top 3, but like I said, we weren't going too fast. Yeah, he did 157, that's really fast. He did it. I guess there's not that many moving parts for hardcore. But that's a really good hardcore time. Okay.
Um, kind of doing that to try to get three at a time. I guess you can probably get three at a time here if you're quick. Or here. No, you probably can't get it. Okay. Not sure if we got three at a time at any point. We can do it during reassembly as well. I just think I just won't want to screw this up. Yeah, let's trigger here first. Then this part. Yeah, I'll probably could we do game mode, see if I can get it in game mode, because I'm not gonna be getting it in this one. Put it away. Um Is that okay? Here. I think I've got one other thing. Must have forgot one other piece. Just thinking of what that piece would have been that I would have forgot. Oh. There, probably. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, here we can get three easily. One, two... Three, four, five, six, seven. You can do here, 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 here. Okay, so what do we got here next? Here. Mm, yeah, that's all part of the trigger assembly, so we're good there. Like I said, I just don't want to screw it up and lose my sniper. Because I have it. I know I'm not getting the best time because I'm already way into it, so. Just gotta s do it smart. Okay, so I think that's everything. So, bolt assembly. Forum assembly. Elevator. Bolt slide. Cartridge stop. Hot trigger housing. Trigger pin. 67. Move the put in the barrel. 69. Guess we could. I can do game mode and camera and see how fast I can do it. Sniper, hardcore player, expert, top three. Yeah, but I got a top three because there's only three people. But I could do it another day. But we'll quickly see how quickly we can do game mode. Don't know if we can get top one, but I'll give it a shot. Just really gotta think my way through this and be really as fast as possible. all about how few camera rotations you can do it in. So if you're not comfortable with the gun, it's hard to do it in really few camera rotations. But you can actually hide your camera rotations behind stuff like that. And you also need to watch the bottom there. And whenever that turns off, you click your next part. Cause you don't want to lose serenity by clicking too much. And you want to make sure you don't forget any parts either, because if you forget parts, that's your whole thing lost. Okay, here I have to have confidence in my pieces, because this is where I often take a lot of time. Oh shit, I misclicked. See, going too fast. Just barely missed my click, but just barely is missing, so. Here. There. 
as soon as it flips you gotta click on the next piece you can also watch for it to stop glowing but I don't find that's really as useful see so you lost a second there remember don't click too much because you could lose serenity then you have to start over anyway Done. Magazine. Assembly. Maytown extractor. The real secret is not holding down your mouse when you move. This is a hard thing to remember as you're trying to move the camera around and doing 60 things at once. Okay, so we got that one without failing this time. I'm kind of hoping I didn't forget any pieces. Shit, that kind of got my way. And one. Okay, so we remembered all the pieces. Let's see if we can get back together quick enough to be at the top time. There. Here. You gotta rush. You gotta go quick. And you gotta think of each piece you're gonna hit next as the piece you're putting in is in there. So you don't have time to think afterwards. You can leave the long pieces for last as well, because that will give you a little bit of break to think. It's so like this is a longer break. Gives me a chance to check all my pieces, make sure I have everything. I figure out what piece goes in next, which I know is this piece. So, hit that in. Get that in. Elevator. Bolt slide. Cartridge stop. Cartridge interrupter. Trigger housing. Trigger pin. Sorry, I lost a second there because I had to put, zoom out and make sure I put that piece back in, else I would have failed. So, 301. What's the top time? Time 1, time 2, time 3, expert sniper, top 3. So I actually got time 3, but how fast did he do it? Hmm. Can I cut 6 seconds off? Possibly. But eh, I'll do it another day when there's not as much competition. So, um, I'll also explain this. I don't think I've ever explained this. As you get further from the, the middle has the most competition. This is where you start. These paths here. If you do circles, the further your circle gets out, the less competition there is. So up here, there's almost no competition. Like, look at this. There's two people who did that server game. One person did that hardcore game, which it may not seem like a lot because here only t like three of us did. But look, if you look at the normals, I don't think there's much of a comparison. Nah, well, that's quite a few more if you look at it. That's 11 as compared here with six. So that's almost twice as many. So you automatic bogus automatically got hardcore game. Um, Type easy, all he had to do was get sniper. This guy, all he had to do was finish. This guy, all he had to do was get sniper. He automatically got it for doing super game. So it gets easier and every time you do these, you get a credit. So, pretty easy. Yeah, again, I was gonna say, he probably just had to complete it to get it. Stuff like the flak, no one even did super game and hardcore game for the flak. But flak's kind of expensive because it costs both XP and credits. On my 15 credits because I completed quite a few of my guns. I still don't have the well rod, but like I said, look at the well rod now. 15 people on hardcore, 24 on daily. So, a lot of people. But anyway, guys, I'll stop rambling. Thanks for coming out for more World of Gun Assembly, and we'll see you in the next one. Later, guys.